What's going on bros and girls, today I'm doing a full review of one of the best bang for the buck keyboards you can get. This is the Utech Smart Saturn 7 color backlit gaming keyboard and for its really low price it is absolutely packed with features. One of which is very unique which I'll mention at the end. But before we get onto the review I quickly just want to cover some stuff going on with my channel. So please, bear with me for un petit momento. So as I said, this is a budget gaming keyboard, and though I normally focus on higher end gear on my channel, I had quite a few requests in the comments of other vids and messages and tweets that I should do some budget products. I've done a few already and I still will cover mainly high end gear, but I want to know from you guys if you enjoy me reviewing some budget stuff once in a while. I know lots of my subscribers are audiophiles and high end PC enthusiasts and gamers, but I also know there are some subs out there that are a bit younger and may not have high paying jobs, or those of you who don't have as much disposable income. So I want to cater to as many viewers as possible, so please comment down below on what you want to see, be it top of the line products, budget products, or a combo of both. The channel is for you guys and not me. Also, I told you guys in my last video on the Meze 11 earphones, if I get 100 likes on it, I'd post up my next vid within a few days, and I genuinely want to thank each and every one of you for your support on that initiative, and just yesterday I got 100 likes on it, so as promised, this is the next vid up the very next day. I am very grateful for all of you bros and girls who hit that thumbs up button, and I think that's a good way to show support, and it lets me know that the time and effort I put into these vids are appreciated. So let's do this again, if I get 100 likes, I promise to you all, I'll have another vid up within a few days of hitting that milestone. Alright, so enough about my channel, back to the product. As usual with all my reviews, uh, which are always unbiased, I'll start with any cons I've found and leave off on a good note with the pros. And since I'm sure by now a lot of you want to know just how affordable this keyboard is, I've included some links for you down below for some of the best pricing and availability. So I only have two cons and they are mainly just nitpicks and for the most part are the result of keeping the cost as low as possible. The first is the packaging which is very plain and not very aesthetic. It pretty much looks like an OEM box with some logos, specs, and instructions all in grayscale. I do admit it's probably the unboxer in me which led me to notice this, and I'm sure most of the people who buy this won't be bothered by the packaging or will understand this is a budget product and some sacrifices had to be made. And yes, I'd much rather have that sacrifice in the box as opposed to on the product itself. The only other con is the non-removable wrist rest. This Saturn is comfortable for me and its general shape doesn't seem like it would be offensive for anyone in terms of ergonomics, but I think including a removable wrist rest would make it usable for even the pickiest of users. Again, like I said though, the low cost of this keyboard probably was a reason for not including this feature, and most people shouldn't have any comfort problems with the Saturn. So this relates to our first pro, which is its design and comfort. Even with the static wrist rests, I find the angle the Saturn places the wrist to be optimal for both typing and gaming, and after many weeks and hours of using this keyboard, I had zero cramping or fatigue in the wrists. Key-wise, though not a mechanical keyboard, and I guarantee you won't find one at this price, the rubber domes on this membrane keyboard is very easy to depress, and again, after many hours straight, no discomfort on my fingers either. It's also pretty damn quiet compared to most mechanical models, and here's a sample if you want to have a listen. The next pro is the 7 color backlit keys. You have the option to choose from red, green, dark blue slash indigo, yellow, a light blue slash teal color, purple, or a nice clean white. This is actually 6 more colors than most of what the big gaming brands offer, which is one of either blue, green, or red. And the products that do have the multiple color options cost even more, sometimes even over 3 times the price of the Saturn. Third Pro relates to the colors and it's the customizability. Not only can you change the colors, but you can also change the brightness of each color, and if you don't want any color at all, you can turn it off completely and the keys are still clearly visible from its laser engraved keycaps. Also another nice feature is the breathing function, which as the keyboard is breathing, it cycles through all the colors, which you can also customize the speed of the cycling. Another pro is just the sheer amount of features on this keyboard. Other than what I already mentioned, it also has full media control keys, keys to open your email and navigate your web browser, as well as a function key to lock the Windows button. You can even lock every single key if say your cat, dog, or house hippo decides to jump onto the desk and casually walk all over the keys. 
The last part I told you guys I'd leave off with is special because it's the first time I've ever come across a keyboard that has this. It has 10 drain holes on the bottom for liquid to seep through and the box says this keyboard is waterproof. This means if you get too excited on your computer and spill your liquids through the keys, it will just drain through the holes. So no worries at all my excited friend. If you guys do want to see this ability in action, there's other videos up where guys test this with water. So all in all, I am very impressed with this keyboard, especially at such a low price point. It has features much more expensive models from the big gaming brands don't even have. This is probably one of the best value gaming keyboards out there at the moment. Even if this was about twice the price, I would still think this is a good deal for the features that you're getting. If you want this keyboard for yourself, as I said, make sure to check out the links below for some of the best pricing and availability. So I hope you guys all enjoyed my full review of the Utech Smart Saturn 7 color backlit waterproof gaming keyboard. And like I said, let me know if you guys want me to still review some budget products alongside the usual high-end models I cover. I would really appreciate your input on this matter. Or even if you have any other suggestions for different products I should review. And any questions, my subscribers know I always try to answer each and every one of you, so feel free to ask. So if you did enjoy this video, please thumbs up if you liked it, thumbs down if you didn't, and let me know your thoughts in the comments. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and follow me on Twitter and or my personal Instagram if you want to see more of this guy's life in the real world. Until next time, YouTube. Peace.